Oh well. Today on more jokes added to my stream that only I'll get. Well, nobody will get them too. But only we'll get it. And that's all that really matters. If I don't... I don't know. My jokes aren't going to appeal to everyone. Sorry, I saw like something flash out of the corner of my eye. And it's because, uh... I guess I lined up the two metallic poles next to me. So like my lamp and like a clothes hanger. And it reflected perfectly as I turned my head a little bit. It was fucking wacky, but... This bar is too damn cold. So I think my mice a little bit quiet. Hopefully it should be better now. Now. Okay. I've noticed that the last few streams that I've been paying somewhat attention, hopefully. Alright, uh... I get to remember what I was trying to do, uh, Monday. I don't remember what I did yesterday. I didn't mean to expand that, but, uh... So it goes. Who am I? I don't fucking- Why are you asking me that? I don't fucking know. Who are you? Where am I? What am I doing? What are you doing? Oh, brother. I'm gonna go see if I... Did you convert? I don't think I have a Tentamon yet. I'll get a Tentamon. Why not? Then, uh... I definitely don't have Biomon either. So I'll get the- I'll get the Season 1 Digimans. Just so the boys on Farm Island 2 have more fun. I guess I should check to make sure I don't have anyone maxed out. I don't see anyone. Yeah, I hope they're just chilling, having a good time. Oh yeah, I need to talk to this dweeb. Hey, fans, what are you doing here? Well, I'm just glad you're here. You know where Sakura is now? Um, no, not in particular. There's no deep meaning there. I'm worried because she's been odd lately. Whoa, say what? She's gone missing? Alright, now I'm peeking my fucking mic. I hate it here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. Back it up. I want to hear everything. Jimothy Ken music video? That reminds me, she said something before about an evil pilgrimage or something. Oh no, she's Morbin. This evil pilgrimage seems to be some event where only select few fans get to meet Jimothy Ken. No way, not Sakura. She's crazy, she'll be surrounded by hackers. It's too dangerous for her to go by herself. I'm coming for you, Sakura, hang on! I should probably go do something about that. I better report back first. Yeah, Jimmy Ken's actually just Jared fucking Leto. Prove me wrong. You can't. Both are mid as fuck. I'll die on that fucking hill. I remember with my... The first relationship I was in, we were at her house watching Fight Club. She only wanted to watch Fight Club because Jared Leto was in it. 
And I'm pretty sure Jared Leto's only in it for like a few minutes. And when he came on screen, she's like, whoa, look, there's Jared Leto. I'm like, who? I was super just staring at Brad Pitt's abs like any straight man does. Hell yeah. An evil pilgrimage, you say? In all likelihood, that's where Sakura is gone. And the evil pilgrimage seems to be aptly named. Jimmy Ken may be a frightful man in more ways than one. Yeah, he's real scary. Ice is lulls. And I just finished looking into that music video. That disturbing video was pretty fucking cool. I think Jimmy Ken's hot. You're fired. Ah, Pants, you're here. Hey, what's this all about? Everywhere you go, that Jimmykin video's playing. Does this, this relate to the questions you were asking, Pants? No. But look at that! Even here you've got that video playing! The video's got some fiendish stuff encoded into it. I tried to avoid watching much of it if I were you. What? What? Wait, what? Fiendish? You may have heard of this particular trick. It's called subliminal messaging. Smoke. <laughs> Subdermal me messages? Subliminal messages. Simply put, messages are sent directly to the brain by slipping images from one video into another so fast they can't be seen. That video is subliminally set to be as addictive as a drug. It effectively hypnotizes you. What's scarier is what it makes you do afterwards. There's a post-hypnotic suggestion built in. I don't have any idea what you're talking about, but that's what made Sakura disappear? Without a doubt. The suggestion includes a certain URL. I couldn't get the whole address, but it strongly resembles the area in which we captured the Digimon Metal Thief. The location's on Kowloon Level 4. Get there ASAP and check it out for me. Darn it, Pants, why didn't you tell me? Cause I'm going to! Sakura's my friend, I have to help! That jerk of a devil worshipping idiot! Oh great, now we got the fucking goof troop with us. Alright, uh, friends. I don't go to school these days. Just kidding, or am I? What do you think? Uh, IDC, LOL. Most of the kids I talked to today are orphans. Glad we live in peace time. <laughs> What the fuck, dude? How is this? How is this the conversation? <laughs> hey, son. Just fucking talk to a bunch of orphans. Sucks to be them. Glad we don't have to deal with that, right? Haha. <laughs> yeah, mom. Yeah, where is LAMAO in all caps? I think that's the valid response, right? Oh, oh, would you look at that? I need a free type Digimon that's rookie or better. Do I really not have one? Oh, I should have one with Ankylamon now. Cool. The homie. Alright, let's go to fucking Kaupu. Wait. I'm not in a... I'm not in a case right now, right? Hell yeah. Three platinums to come on, metal. You get a uh, get a good warm up in from Rusty, Rusty and Krusty. This time that can be.
Alright, free dub. Free money. in our fucking uh rank. We ballin'. My body did that fun thing last night where uh I slept and I slept wrong. So I have to deal with the consequences of my uh subconscious self. Hello, Knox. Everyone's favorite song, Kowloon. I hate the Kowloon level 3 ones, there's so many places that it should be. Pin doesn't sometimes doesn't connect to that. Yeah, that's why I, like I just don't use a a VPN for that exact reason. It's not worth it 95% of the time, unless I'm doing some illegal shit. Which I would never do illegal shit, haha, unless. Also hello rain, welcome. Look extra hairy today. Yeah, it's because I let my hair down. All this hair is usually in two very tight braids. But today is the day where I need to redo them anyway, so I'm like, fuck it, I'll just stream with my hair down and flex on people. Very easy. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm glad I'm at the the part of my life where I'm able to be a guy with long hair. Because there are some fucking haters out there. Starting with every member of my family. Uh, you look homeless. Yeah. Congratulations. Where did you buy that joke? The poop store? So original. It's like being left home alone. Sorry for making you feel that way. Damn. Not interested, huh? No biggie. Just shooting the breeze. Forget about it. Yeah, so right now it's 40 degrees Fahrenheit um, outside and it's been fucking pouring like hell all day. Which leads me to the point. Uh, my power might just go out? I don't know. The. the the weather is super shitty today. Um, so like, a majority of the year it's fine. Um, that's why I keep it in braids most of the time, because if I, like, if I leave it out, it's just painful. In the summer, especially. It's like, you'll sweat, then you're, like, with curly hair, the shit just mats at the slightest, like, inclination towards uh, any liquid. And it's just, it, it fucking sucks. But I used to, I used to do ponytail. I got a bit too long for that, because, like... Like, I don't know how obvious it is, but, like, it goes, it keeps going. Like, it, it's fucking long, dude. Like... I, my arm's fully stretched out. And I'm not a small guy. 
It has a wave like it because I keep it in braids and it's just naturally curly. My hair used to like be way tighter curled too. It's it's kind of weird how that changed. Cause I used to just have like the Jufro where my hair would just kind of like go out like that. But that just stopped at some point. I'm not quite sure why. I just got too long, yeah. I think usually I would just get, uh, I, I would never find out how how long my hair could get because I would just get fucking pressured out of it. Like if I didn't cut my hair for like. I don't know, more than like two months. My family just immediately start fucking beating down on me like, Why did you cut your hair yet? You look, you look, you look so bad, what are you doing? And I'm like, shut the fuck up. Let me live, man. Very long as I can do it. Ding dong. Oh, fuck, that's like 152 HP. <laughs> Apologies in advance if the stream is a uh, lower energy than my usual low energy streams. Uh, I think I mentioned it last stream, but I've been working on getting like a, a zero online server set up. And uh, it turns out that's really fucking hard. Because like I've just been setting up VMs and shit for like three days after work. The fuck is Zero Online? It's a game I played when I was like 15. Um, I just think I have a very distinct core memory of playing it while listening to Church by T-Pain. Um, if that paints the picture of when it was popular. Um, that was also when I didn't have money, like free spending money. So I would, uh, um, I would go on like MMORPG.com and just download the ones that looked cool. And that was that was how I entertained myself. But it was like a it was a mecha like MMO. It was really neat game. Like it was just fun to play and looked cool. Um And every once in a while like the memory just popped in my head and I'd be like, man, I really fucking missed that game. Even though I didn't really play, like, I played it a lot, but not like a lot, a lot, like MMO a lot. I put like 30 something hours into it, but it just stuck with me. Um, I was looking into it, and I found like a thread on some random forum that was like, start a private server. And I'm like, oh shit, no way, I can do that? Um, the current answer is looking like, no, I cannot. But, yeah, it's a game from, like, there are files in there from 2008. And I, like, I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do with that shit, to be quite honest. But, like, I, there are, like, guides from 2011 and, like, 2013 and 2015 and shit. 
There's so much that's changed in tech since then, you know. So I don't really know what's going on with it. But I know the problem I'm having, I can't solve it, and it's awful. But yeah, my whole week has just been, like, I work until 5, I get off, and then I fuck around with that until 2 or 3 in the morning. And I wake up at 9. And I wonder why I feel like shit. My next play is to take the old ass Windows 7 PC I have and uh, try it on that. On like actual hardware. But I, I don't remember if that PC got upgraded to Windows 10 at some point, or if my parents just kept it on 7. I know I was sitting in my living room, so. Just, uh, I want to say it's a fun, uh, thing to learn, but it really just, it really isn't. I'm lying to myself. It, this is pure code. Yeah, like, it, it's, it's interesting to know how little I know, I think. I think that's the part that's quote-unquote fun. Um, but what comes with that is feeling like a complete fucking dumb asshole 24-7 uh, while you're reading shit written by people 10 years ago. An hacker has repented. Hooray. But yeah, who knows? I, I'll probably get it at some point. I'm probably not gonna think about it until either the random guy I DM'd on that forum uh, responds to me, which he probably won't, let's be real. You know there's a track on the island? Was there a train too? Yeah. Um. Hell yeah, slut ranked up. Real cyber slut. Hog. Um, but yeah, like, it's just gonna be a bunch of me fucking, uh, beating my head against the wall until something works, but it, like, it might just literally not work. My last ditch effort is, uh, fully decompiling the server so I can look at the code and figure out what's doing wrong and debug it. Um, which I have no clue how to do. So I'd be completely shooting in the dark and it's a nightmare. Now I'm a real sleuth. Yes. Finally. What a time to be alive. I can finally reach my full sleep potential. Wait, quite the rabbit hole I'm traversing? Yeah, a little bit. I really would kind of prefer not to at this point, but uh, I'm, I'm kind of in too deep. Them's, them's the breaks of uh, trying to reload your child in 2023. You either get the game remastered poorly, or it's lost to media, or it costs $500. Okay, I don't have to do that again. I don't know. I might even, like, depending on... If I ever get it to work, I might just actually host it for friends to... But that's that's definitely jumping, uh, jumping the gun a bit at this point. Oh shit. 
Kabuto mod and put er, no, it's Kabu Terry mod. I'll fucking do that. <laughs> this fucking actually erased. Jesus. Get dazed, Moran. Your time is up. We haven't heard much from Zaxxon lately. Maybe a whole new team like Jude is gonna sprout up. I doubt it. Most of the hacking engines in town have been a product of what they call of that new ex Zaxxon team. Demons, they're called. Ooh. Epic. That's so scary. Cool. My mustache just clocked up. What the fuck? I didn't think I was on the random one. They're just dropping HP sprays now. Let's fucking go. Where are we going? I don't know. Somewhere. Ooh, it feels like we're pretty far inside here. That's what she said. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> I'll laugh at my own fucking jokes. <sighs> Every time I come to Kowloon, I get the creeps. Relax, no kill. We'll protect you. We can stay with you here in cyberspace. Agumon! Gabumon! What would I do without you two? Suffer. Hey, hey, Nokia, look at that! <laughs> Ow! Sakura, I... Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on! Stop! What are you guys doing? What's this shiny thing? No way! Torture in this day and age? What's it to you, you know him? Come on, Barrick! It, it, it's unforgivable! Unforgivable? Really? So what if it is? You gonna do something about it? Yes! Yes we are! Right, Pants? Go get him! That's my favorite cyber slut! Okay, let's do this! What? You're not doing anything, Nokia? That, that's right, I'm not doing anything! That's right, it's dangerous, don't do anything. You need to be somewhere safe and just watch as your friend does the fight. <laughs> Boah! Uh, is that what a real friend is? Is that, uh, what friends do? Oof! <laughs> oh, gee, is that just... Oh, I feel like just the worst! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. You think you just ignore us? Yes. Are you kidding with this crap? I will mess you up. Alright. What the fuck? Oh, dear. Oh. Ah. Nice damage, idiot. Where'd you buy it? The poop store? The poop? I'm gonna start talking mad shit and I'm gonna get fucking back back to back Jimmy Ken. I'm gonna fucking just shit my pants. Also I did look it up. 
yesterday because I was curious, or at some point between last stream and now. Um, but uh, acceleration charge, damn, get fucking erased, idiot. Um, it does, in fact, double your damage on the next turn. So that's a pretty good, pretty good move. Bonk. Dead. Well, the thing is, it doubles your damage, but you can still crit. <laughs> Ow, I won't forget this. Don't let him get away. He knows where Sakura is. I'm on it. Agumon, Gabumon. Yes, ma'am. Understood. Hand it over. Hand it over now. Your butthole. Oh, that. Okay, okay. I sent the data. Haha, <laughs> I did it. Now what? You let yourself fall victim to the Digimon capture scan to find out where Sakura is? <laughs> <laughs> but I've beaten them at their own games. Yeah, but what the heck was the data you wanted so badly? Here, Pants, take this. That's where the de demon's hideout is. Sakura's gotta be there. Ow! I'm hitting the circle button. I don't care about this dweeb. He does this shit every time. It didn't work. Haha, <laughs> guess I overdid a little. This account is falling apart. But forget about me. Hurry up and find Sakura. Ugh. This dude just fucking died again. I'm leaving the rest up to you. I meant to do. Ryota, no! Hey, Nokia, why are those guys so worked up? Good question. It's because they're going through adolescence. Adolescence? You know, youth. Youth. Is that any different from the junior high school disease you talked about before? Oh, well, they're similar, but... Junior high school disease is when you become a youth after you somehow manage to DNA ditch evolve. Huh, I don't really get it, but humans are fascinating. Uh, right, I guess. Let's go to the Demon's Den. Of course it's fucking called the Demon's Den. Ooh, epic, edgy. Can show you, you little brat. Take this. <laughs> oh, shit. Did I just drop like XP, like free experience? And it did. Uh, you know, that's gotta go to the boy. I feel like 2500 XP is not that much anymore. Which kinda sucks, but... So it goes. Alright. Can I just walk around this guy and fucking, uh... Take the shit, or is he gonna, like, try and fight me for it? You can't take my treasure unless you beat my Digimon. Now fight us. Oh shit, it's poop from poop. He's back. Sorry, poop from poop, but I have to. No handouts here. Well, then I'll just take it. Poof and poof's too powerful. No signal. 
Well, that sounds like a problem. See if I can actually talk to this guy and fight him. If I can't, then whatever. How's my week? Fucking exhausting. You want a battle? You think you got a chance? You can see through, you can see the flame drum behind me, right? Or are you looking over here because you want to fight? Yeah. Where up? I mean, I'm gonna get my fucking ass beat again. Oh wait, this one's not nearly as strong. What the fuck? Cool. Uh, yeah, like I like I mentioned before, like I spent a bunch of my time working on a private server that I just never got working. So I was like working on that till 3 a.m. every night, then waking up and working. But I got really wrapped up in it and made zero progress, which was red. Ralmon's closer to death, could worry about that. This gonna hurt. No. Not that bad. How was yours, Moss? How was your week? I kinda hate the like free type. I feel like it's a really lame cop out. Even normal types in Pokemon have like a counter, but you can only counter on like 1.5x. Are you looking for a nostalgia fix? Yeah, for a game I played like forever ago. I don't even know if it's possible to do in 2023. Like with all the TLS changes and shit, but it should be fine. I don't know. I can't. I don't know why it's working. Or why it's not working, rather. It's really fucking annoying, though. It's about as fun as pulling teeth, though. Because, like... You just mess with ports and IPs and hope that it just works. But you don't know what it's wrong, like what's wrong with it. Gargamon do you do? Yeah. yeah, it's not my idea of fun. I'm sure some people get really into it, but uh, at the moment I have zero ways to progress. Um, so that's a that's a fun feeling. This guy has so much fucking HP. I wish Zudamon went faster than death. Oh, I have Ice Dead Ball. What the fuck am I doing? Damn, we have an acceleration boost on a normal attack. Kinda cringe. before I even have a chance to do anything. See if I can get one of those off. That's good damage. Ouch. Still. 
I just use clock mode too. Safe in case uh she decides to just go sicko mode and shit on my life. I'm sorry, I acted so big. I'm the one who didn't really see your Digimon's strength. So forgive me. Yeah, someone said egg. Memory up. Miracle meat. Finally, miracle meat. Did you eat great egg and grape with a courageous crest? Hooray. I'm guessing that's just gonna, I guess that's just an optional boss, right? Like, now I just can go get Fungamon? That's what I I should definitely sell these at some point, but uh, I'll do that. I'll do that later. Right Can I explain my Digimon choices? No. I picked them because they look cool. What kind of person is my mother? I don't know. But no, like, I, I really don't have a rhyme or reason to my choices. Gargamon's obvious because he's fucking Gargamon. Why would I? I if I didn't have him in my party, I would get fucking just shot on sight. Uh, Clockmon's whatever. He has his attack that does 150 flat, which is nice. Um, Zudamon is big and has big hammer move. Ice Devimon has death penetrating water. Uh, War Growlmon does hella damage and has 250 electric. Rurumon is very fast and has a uh, good coverage. Angulomon, uh, I have because I like them. Gargo on these ones. Damn. I can't believe it. I've never heard or said that one many times before. I'm just shocked and appalled. Bailiff, wacky pee pee. And on that note, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Cause I gotta pee. I'll be right back.
And I'm back. And I get pinged immediately. Leave me alone! I'm supposed to fucking... God damn, I'm dumb. I'm supposed to put it back to new mom. I just completely forgot what, what that one was. Hope I had a good piss, thank you, I did. It almost all got in the toilet. I was very proud of myself. Bro, this looks- this does look exactly like those fucking graphic spots on Twitter. Like they designed it. The songs themselves aren't so bad. What the? What's wrong with me? Whoa! I'm not just taking a trip on the dark side. What's that? You know where Sakura is? Okay, I'm coming. Sakura, we're here to save you. Fuck, I didn't read it. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Who are you? What do you want? But you know, my evil pilgrimage, that takes some guts. You can even say it rocks. Ah, it's you, the girl from earlier. The one who's harping all over me because of Digimon. You, you right little harpy. A little what now? A right little what now? Do you, do you understand this guy, Pants? Harping, harpy. Yeah, wait, was that the whole joke? Bad pun alert. Super bad pun alert. What's going on? Is that a TV camera? Wait, are we... We're smack dab in the middle of an airway jacket? Wait a minute, this mean my face is now in living rooms across the nation? Oh, I'm not ready, a mysterious beauty needs time as she has to be talked about the next day. You fool, lulls, the camera only faces me. My incredible talent alone is what shines through. But this music video is playing all over town. I'm talking live. It don't mean nothing unless it's live, lulls. Sorry, that was nice. These wicked fans of mine, possessed by the power of the video, have come here to listen. And now a great crowd of wicked of my wicked fans will come to listen to me rock out. What are you talking about? The kids who are here because you, you because of the salmonella messages in your, in your music video. What? The what messages? Wait, you mean the subliminal messages? Raffle. Alright, she deserved to get clowned for that one. Uh, yeah, right, that's it. Algumon, Gabumon, smash that camera! Ah, ah, no freaking way! Why are you smash my camera? <clears throat> we got that thing special from you know who. It was a very special, sweet memory. You know who said my songs need to be heard by more and more people? You know who said I needed to become way more popular? You really shouldn't be broadcasting your washed up glam rocker face on, in the living rooms anymore. OMG? Who are you calling washed up? Wait, I get it. You're totally ripping off that one band. They were American, I think, or maybe British? You know, something like Kicks or Lips or whatever. He's doing the rage face, Pog. He's doing the rage face line. That's the one from the comics. Uh, yeah, woo, rage face, wahoo. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. 
I ain't ripping anybody. I ain't ripping off nobody no how. I will not. No, I cannot let that slide. This time there will be absolutely no mercy. Agamon, Agamon, are you ready? This time we're gonna, we're all gonna save a friend. What? But earlier you said. Now's my chance. What the fuck? Do you feel it? Nope. Don't want to. Actually. I saw that damage. I'm good. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Alright, so they're... Okay, so I need my fucking uh, virus boys out. Alright, so... <laughs> Yeesh. What's up, Blue? Welcome. I'm gonna get worked over by Jimothy Ken again for the fourth time in the fucking game. Oh, how nice he buffed me. Now I just need to never get hit by anything, actually. Yeah, uh, this is disgusting, actually. Everyone loves Jimmy Cannon's air guitar? No. I actually hate him. I hate everything about him. I especially hate the fact that his fucking goons take 8 billion damage. Love that cool guy team on the side. Oh, uh, you mean Agumon and Gobmon? Or the fucking, uh. The Cyber Goss gone wrong. How's how you guys doing? I'm getting shit on. As you can see. Cyber Ghost gone right? No, I think the Cyber Ghosts are intrinsically right. Cyber Ghost did nothing wrong. Do you feel it? No. What about a Cyber Goth rave? Have you seen Cyber Goths outside of a Cyber Goth rave? Hit him with it, Chief. 15 damage. Counter! Bro, they're on like Comet Hammer 3 and shit. I'm like, how am I supposed to keep up with this garbage? Alright, someone's dead. Never mind, Anchor Roman can tank one hit. Stop using that attack, man. It's too fucking strong. Alright, well, fuck me, I guess. Whatever. This is looking like a, uh... Looking like a go-next angle. Or a, uh... I need to see if I can paralyze an angle with one of the two. Super work too. 
But of course, it's a boss fight, so... Lamau. Do you think you can, uh... Sleep anyone? Lamau. Raffle. Thank god, Agumon has infinite HP. <sighs> Dude, it'd be so funny if I had that set up. Like, I played through this before. And, like, I just had it set up to the point where, uh, I could go hit play. Wouldn't that be real funny? Imagine getting a turn ever. So... Imagine, uh... Damn, did I say not fought in half my coat? That's hilarious. Um... Yeah, imagine actually being allowed to play the game. And not being, uh, panicked for fucking 14 turns in a row. Just to die right when you have the chance to come back. Oh wow. Now I get to, uh, waste a turn healing. Almost it's like not even worth it. Whatever. If I wait long enough, I'll eventually win because uh, Agumon and Gobmon can just tank everything forever. You know what? Here's here's the Giga Brain idea. I just assume I'm never going to get a turn, so I use my strongest attack that puts me at, like, disadvantage for a turn. Who cares if I get stunned? They're gonna panic with me anyway. I don't know, this one might this one might still be winnable until I get hit by a Tomahawk Stinger and die. You don't get to take my agency away. I get to take my agency away. I do like the fact that you have guests in this one though, that actually tank hits. Very kind of them. I wonder if that stacks. I also feel like, uh, this is gonna be another one of those ones where, uh, the second both the side ones die, the main one's gonna go fucking ape shit and kill me. I'm very excited for that. Oh. Well, I'm just killing this one, so...
so when that kills him... Oh. I'm still lucking out. certain the second that hits my boy. Oh, that that is a hundred percent fucking stacking. That is terrifying. Once I hit my war ground on, I'm fucking dead. Oh, oh, now, now, really? You've had that the whole time. Can you feel it? Uh oh, RNG roll. Oh, I live. Hell yeah. Right, I think my I think my strat is I bring in teammates. If for no other reason than the tank hits. And buff me. Well, one's gonna draw a tomahawk stinger now. It'll probably be fucking guarding one. Oh, it wasn't. Perfect. That's gonna be deep. Okay, so he's just on a, a can you feel it and, uh,. I feel like he's just stuck in a loop right now. Which, uh, I fuck with. Get him, Gargamon. That should be a can you feel it? Yep. If I don't, uh, I actually run the risk of dying, which sucks. Just do that, whatever. I don't want to use a capsule, but I also don't want to waste my time. Alright, who gets it? Thank you, Goblin. I'm almost certain that's not gonna work, so I don't know if I want to even try. Refresh um, this, sure. It's not even worth trying to hit it, because I'm gonna do 0.5. Probably throw a death boost at him next turn too. Make sure he definitely lives. Get him. I'm a hot stinger. Dead. Have I played this game before? No, I haven't. That's why it says blind in the title. 
Alright, do I go with that or do I just go fucking. Do I go balls to the wall? Fuck it. We ball. I don't care. Hell yeah. Jimmy can win on the first try challenge. Successful. Titty laser, titty lasers solo. <laughs> Excellent. This is what real friends are like, Nokia. Who do I think I am? Lavos? No. What's Lavos? This is what real friends are like, Nokia. Dang it! Why is that the end like this for me? I just wanted to bring my simple, pure rock and roll to as big an audience as possible. And I finally got help from you know who. Why is man trying to get himself cancelled on Twitter? Why, why are you making Harry Potter references in this fucking term, tumultuous time? And I don't know how I'm going to tell... You keep, say, you keep saying you know who. Who the heck are you talking about? You know who is, uh, is you know who, duh. Little Miss Rie. M -m -m Miss Rie? You know her pants? Nope, can't say I do. I don't know shit. That's enough. Huh? Oh, it's you guys. Jimmy, look at you. You're pathetic. I was against using phones like you from the very start. Oh, it, it. Damn, she just fucking killed that guy. He's dead. Jimmy can actually just got fucking executed on live TV. Holy shit, what a fucking... Rock and roll. You're what we'd call a filthy pig down on the farm. Look at me, I'm a character smiling in fucking Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Hey, you, what are you doing? I was the one who's gonna bombard him with questions. You stay out of this, you frumpy little haglet. What? Frumpy? Me? You, you jerk face. I am so not frumpy. You're the frumpy one calling me frumpy. So there, and what do you have, What do you mean by stay out? How are you involved with all this? Not only are you frumpy, you're too nosy for your own good. Shut your fool mouth before I shut it for y'all. Please shut up. Please shut up. Please shut up. You just had to run your fucking mouth. Why? Oh. I'm not fighting. These aren't. Not my monkeys, not my fucking circus. I don't care. So that's fucking bullshit. I thought the fucking I had my foot so far in my fucking mouth. No way, she's too strong. I'm no match for Agumon, Gabumon, I'm so sorry. Hey, so give it a rest for now. Ha! As if if this is the best she can do, I can whoop her. I said to knock it off. Or do you mean to divide me as well? Gosh, I'd never. I, I couldn't possibly. I would never betray you. Just don't even say it. This incident was an oversight on my part. I apologize. 
Huh? He just wanted to attract greater crowds, which is why he hijacked the air raids. Someone at Kamishiro prompted him, though. Kamishiro? Then that means... That Kimiko is nothing more than a Kamishiro pawn. Undoubtedly, it was Rie Kishibe who put the idea in his head, and the hijacking program in his hands. Then if Kimiko testifies to that fact... No good. Nothing is done but of his own free will. He has been as skillfully manipulated as the girls he controlled with his supposed hypnotic suggestions. But you go, how come you know about this place? Did not tell you, you frumpy little thing. Stay out of this. I'll send coordinates for the location where girls are gathering in the real world to your terminal. Sorry to make you clean up this mess, but thank you. Let's go, Pei. Hang on just one gosh darn minute. You're lucky I have a thing for a weak and frumpy things. Kinda makes me want to punch a wall though. Next time I won't go so easy on y'all. Man, I would've wiped that fucking Digimon with my fucking ass, dude. Well, what's up with her? We've got Yugo and Kamishiro and this and that and it's, all, it's just all so stupid complicated. So, that's right! We came to save everyone who's on Jimmy Kin's evil pilgrimage! What happened to the green haired girl? I'm pretty sure that's Rie. Right? I don't know. She's definitely some. Macho Man Randy Savage is definitely a higher up at Kamishiro. Sakura, all you girls suffering from the Pomeranian effect, are you okay? First of all, let's head back to the agency. I definitely don't want to pick up what's on that fucking stage. <clears throat> I see. Then you were able to safely rescue all those who had been subliminally brainwashed? Yeah, but they're all in the hospital now. Nothing to worry about. There are specialists who can break post-hypnotic suggestions. More importantly, how are you doing? I heard the hackers did some nasty things to you. I'm perfectly fine. I just want to... I'm going to look up, look in on Sakura. I'm still really worried about her. Ah, uh, the passion of you. Well then, mind if I ask about the highlights of the case? No. I refuse. Uh, if I were to summarize the police report, it would probably read like this. The demons and Kamishiro conspired together. But assuming Kamishiro is behind the sting of cases, just what exactly are they after? We're missing something. But why? Or will that something make itself known? Is trying to jump to a conclusion with what little info we have now too big a risk? Let's proceed on the possibility that we're either missing something, or that something will turn up. Thanks for all your effort again. You have my thanks as well, Nokia Shiramine. Oh, well, uh, thanks. Um, thanks. Do you have a second? I want to talk to you outside real quick. How can I make my Digimon stronger? Ooh, eh. She wants to talk outside, huh? Maybe this is also the passion of youth at work. Eh. Enough of that. Any progress on the Kamishiro and Nile Corporation case, old man? Don't rush me. I'm in the process of clearing some, old, some key obstacles. It's like I always said. Haste makes waste, right? And I need to make haste to the toilet so I can make some waste. <laughs> um, Pants, I, I just... What? I will never forgive what those hackers did. They use such adorable Digimon so selfishly as their puppets, as their slaves. And the Digimon were so miserable, I felt so, so bad for them. When I saw what you were doing, I knew I needed to do something too. Looking on from the sidelines isn't good enough. There must be something I can do to help. I just can't think of any specific, anything specific I can do right now. But if I do, you'll be the first to know. Look forward to it. Ma'am, your Godmon just tanked fucking 35,000 damage. Okay, it's on. I'm gonna use the power of my sexy cute bod to the max. Nokia Shiramine, work your stuff. I hate this game, actually. Get her out. 
remove her. I haven't picked up any cases yet. Better pick up, pick on a few. She's trying her best. She needs to try more. Get get a better best, really. They do want full pants and paw. Trees on the farm island have fruit you can shake off. Don't eat too much though. Real shit. And it'll be bad. Alright, first I want to get what's on that fucking uh, stage. Jimmy Kin's fucking chastity belt. Deputy Mon Metal. Nice. Jimmy Kin would be the type of guy to fucking buy a graphics effects, uh, or a GFX pack from someone on fucking Twitter. They would follow and be like, whoa, so rockin' cool. And then, uh, yeah, they'd just, they'd just buy it. They'd be like, wow, that's so sick. That was so cool. So rockin' cool, Raffle. Six new cases. Oh, dear. The number one gamer, it's me. Pokemon, Garoomon. This dude, he stop fucking losing his shit. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Oh, yeah, sorry. He loses it in the same area. If he was losing it other places, I'd be like, alright, sure, whatever. Come on, boss. This is platinum poop. Not even the real poop from poop. Oh, I was just fucking took it left. I mean, I don't really care because it's just free money. But, uh, yeah. in the CSP now. It's also a really good opportunity to uh, not fucking do voices for a bit, which is cool. I like doing voices, but I also like not doing voices. Ooh yes. that literally everyone I had is dead. Oh, yeah, I need to go. Oh, 
I need to go to the farm and call them over investigate for it. Honestly, with the right to code, it should be fine. I've had that happen before. Shut up, fuck this out. That's fine. If it's not, well, it's in some way. Yeah, I'd hope that, uh, so like that's good enough, where, uh, if there's like a minor scribble in the address that it doesn't fucking ruin it. Yeah, we'll see. Like being a literal baby Digimon? Well, you see, they're fighting me, not the other way around. At no point am I choosing to fight them. That's their problem, not mine. That being said, it feels pretty good. They don't deserve it, but they kind of do. Shit cake constantly. They will grow up from this and become stronger. Listen to this game where they don't fucking just die. Well, the literal most sadistic shit, like, in any game design ever, is when you have cute monsters or cute something or other, and they run in on ironic risk of dying. I get it. It's nasty. Oh, you can't spin all the time. What's your fucking problem? But like... I don't, I don't need to simulate real life in my video game. Who, who, who wants that? It's like, yeah, I love when my fucking cute monster that I've raised from a small egg over the past 10 hours of my real life life... Uh, it, I love when they die. I'm super big fan of that. Like, we get it. You want to look cool for the fucking cameras. They're so edgy. It makes you feel. Makes you feel something, man. Why don't you go fucking feel grass? How about that? Really, uh, it makes the human condition. How did I fucking miss this again?
Did I talk to him? Did I talk to fucking Peter that one time? But yeah, no, I, I'm really not a big fan of stuff like that. I think it's really lame. But rather, I think there's more productive ways to handle the concept. Like, you can go send them to a farm, literally, and then you're like, they can for you. I got my monster aging, but I don't need that evil in my way. I don't know that evil. This is in like I know when I played Monster Rancher Advance, uh, every time my monster got too old to fight, I would just immediately put it in uh, Trial Fizzy. It's like kind of what you're supposed to do in that game, to be fair. Like you put in Cryo Stasis and you combine it with another one. That's how you're gonna get some other shit. But yeah, I'm not uh I'm not big on them, letting them just fucking die. I'm going to an M. Alright, this dude is literally not never getting turns actually. They have to even vote a turn for him. Back over here. Do you see the Who's it better next time, idiot? wants to talk to me, get in They should not say fucking. Who is it? Oh, 
back. Talking to TRF, Broadway, Hopeful. Oh, this place is nice and cool. Ah, who the hell are you? Huh? You wanna just if you wanna eat, just come inside, did you say? You don't understand. A lady such as myself can't think of going to a place such as this one comes to by the way, the other day I saw a girl left alone outside this place. She looked so lonely. She was fair skinned and had black hair. She was looking at this girl. Perhaps, perhaps only I saw the girl? So hungry, she's hallucinating things. Don't pay any time to new Bonnie if you broke it in yet. While you're around having fun, we got another request for the cyber slut. It's quite a big, complex case. Once you get back to the office, you can find the case on the whiteboard. It's very complex, though. Maybe it just didn't fall into that. Fuck that. Maybe it is in the fucking cafe. Wait, here. Uh... Oh, it's just it's just a fucking connect jump portal. Looks like the top score is VL is long as now. I figured there's like someone I had to talk to. Huh? I was fighting the urge to fucking atomic blast through the Patamon. Very heavily had to fight that urge. Yeah, it's not a matter of deserving it, it's just a matter of my brain like to do it.
There we go. I was also farther away from my mic. Cause I'm I'm just lazy right now. I'm so fucking tired. I will finish out my shift, don't worry. I do have a pizza with my name on it. Let's go see what this boy's got going on. Grappleomon. Oh, I really broke a sweat. What, are you my nice opponent? You don't even look like a video game character. Sure, whatever. I don't care who I'm against. The game character Digimon, as long as they're strong, it's all good. Cool, let's do it. And you better be good. No, I'm shit, so sorry. Ouch. Alright, we're vaccine. Uh... I'm glad the week's finally fucking over. Is that the clock from SMRPG? Almost. Damn, is him the king of fist? Uh, physical attack 90. Idiot. Finger 11 moment. Shouldn't I? That's goofy. Um, whatever.
Digimon is the ultimate crossover game. Unironically, though. Ouch. damage to it. I'm not even paying attention right now. <laughs> Play run but no one's home. Yeah, that's about my life in a nutshell. I was supposed to take a nap before I streamed, and then I didn't, so I could get uh, Malphys from Grandia 2 laughing. <laughs> Naps are for babies anyway, well fucking goo goo gaga bitch. Just hit fucking auto play it. They're just gonna counter me if I do. Uh, I guess guard. Don't want to get countered and die. Damn, Vulcan Napalm 3. Hell yeah, sign me up. Instead, to cool. Wow, you beat me. You are super strong. There aren't any other players in this game stronger than me anymore. I think it's time to move on to a new training ground. But against worthy opponents like you, well, that's a different story. So when do you want to fight again? Tomorrow? Maybe the day after? Huh? You're not a character in this game? You're a detective? Really? So if I went into a game with detectives in it, I could fight lots of strong Digimon users like you? Yeah. You think? I don't need to stay here anymore. I guess it's a goodbye to this game then. Right, it's settled then. Let's go find somewhere to train. Are there any games with lots of detectives in them? Yeah, I went and got that before the fight because I thought that I was going to do the fucking classic of just kicking me out immediately after. I was like, what the fuck, why do I have two messages and they're not in either the inboxes? The other inbox finally gets used. Honestly, I should just tell him to square up. I'm gonna pop out the fucking machine and just beat the shit out of him. What's up, loser? Ah, you're the detective. Your coming here probably has something to do with that GL guy's disappearance, right? What'd you say? GL is a Digimon? Of course, obviously those damn hackers got into the game and started playing as cheat characters. Phew, I'm just glad that cheater's gone. I've just been put back in first place. Thanks for taking my case, much appreciated. Ah, I see there's another game now that's as popular as Top Rapper. That, the game's called Case File 3 Secret Code. There are lots of detectives coming in, hanging around, and carrying out investigations. Recently it's been getting really violent with people bashing in detective characters' faces. For a mystery game, it's pretty scary stuff. Can I go back in and tell him? No? Okay. I was hoping I'd be able to go tell, uh, Graf Leoman. Great work. Oh, I already read that one before. Button boy's mother. Thank you. I try. And by I try, I mean I took it out and it's actually kind of shitty. Um, does it make you feel powerful? Not really. It makes me feel like I pull on my hair a lot. I 
hair, hair down to your ass, it gets caught in the most annoying ways. Ah, you there. You're the detective who took my case. It's nice to meet you. My son Naoya. He's a high school freshman, but he's become a shut-in. He won't go to school. I'd like you to find out the reason for this, please. Recently, all he does is stay in those internet chat rooms. And then there's this Athena girl he met there. They seem to have grown quite close. Yes, well, as it's the internet, you can't really know the person's true identity, can you? Normally, he doesn't talk to the family. Athena's the only one he cares about. He's naive, and it worries me to think that someone's deceiving him. Please, I need you to log on as Naoya and find out what kind of person this Athena really is. I wrote down his ID and password. Bruh. I don't know if Athena will believe you when you say you're Naoya, so I'll give you more information about him. He's 15 years old. No dick. Flat ass. Broke bitch. I mean, he was born in Aomori Prefecture. He hasn't been back to school, back to Aomori since childhood, but he's always said he'd love to go back. His favorite things are games and sleeping. He's got a good memory. He loves hamburgers and his favorite colors are green and white. His strength is that he's honest. His weakness is that he's very shy. Seems like a self-proclaimed basement dweller, like everyone says. Do you think that'll be enough for you? Well, anyway, please investigate Miss Athena. Bruh. Alright, well. Lying down to sleep last night, felt something crawling on your lip. It was just your mustache. Yeah, that's that's happened to me plenty of times. There was a, like a few weeks ago, I was like sitting on the ground, and I'm pretty sure like one of my hairs fell out of my braid and just like tickled my leg. And I freaked the fuck out. I'm like, what is going on? So you just get used to things touching you when you have long hair, unfortunately. Um. Is he a Hikikomori? Uh, yeah, technically. I think he's too young to be one. I think he's just a fucking basement dweller. Oh, hi, Anaoya. How are you today? Wait, didn't you say you wouldn't be able to log on until later this evening because you're going to take part in the arcade event? Really awesome. So you can spend all day talking to me then. Definitely seems like she's Athena. Actually, how long have you been here today? I want to hear more of your stories now, yeah? Yeah, tell me the rest of the story you're telling me about yesterday. About what happened when you went to the arcade the other day. Huh? Oh, uh, no. Not that one. I mean the one about the beat-em-up competition. You said you used the weakest character, but you still won? Uh, now, yeah, just as a test, would it be alright if I asked you a few questions? Now, yeah, what's your job again? I'm a child minder. Yeah, that was it. A student. Though you said you always stay home. Alright, second question. What, what did you say your favorite food is? Hamburger. That's right. You definitely said you liked hamburgers. Maybe the questions were too easy? Okay, last question. This is something I'm always asking about. Naoya, do you like me? I love you. You are my girl. Ah, what? That doesn't sound like you at all. No, he is really shy. He would never come around and say he likes me. He'd just compliment me on my nice points instead. Now I'm sure you're a fake. You're using Naoya's account. What do you want? Just stop. Stop pretending you're now, yeah, Minerva Mon, bruh. I'm gonna get you, bitch! Just wait till I get my fucking hands on you! Yeah, I forgot the part where, uh. said he was shy. Surely that won't impact anything, right? Oh shit, Leomon? Just here? Yeah, it definitely does feel like a choices matter moment. Damn, he's got nipples and everything. Holy.
Oh no, not attack charge. Whatever will I do? Zap. I want Leoman. Leoman is cool. I just need to fight him eight times. Leoman's pretty sus. I don't agree. Why is he wearing pants? Because he's fucking cool, okay? All the cool people wear pants. Where do you think you are right now? Why do you think I want him? He's wearing pants! Damn, with a double Galmon, too. That's crazy. Say I deserve it. Function call level 2 fucking rips. I love being able to force encounters when I want them. That's actually one of my favorite things in games. Ow. Why would you cut me? What the fuck is wrong with you? Let's see. Let's see just like wear moves. Okay. I have idle bubble? Give me that. I don't need that. Awesome clay form is probably better than that. Ocean Wave sucks. Hydro Water Spirit has Ice Archery instead. Oh yeah. Hydro Water is magic. I don't think it is. That's just kind of sauce. Whatever. Let's do that. Yeah, we just want to farm in an area as tight because we can just fucking force the encounter and then you chill. Leomon is actually just married from Grandia 2, but digital. <laughs> I like hitting that button. It's fun to listen to, especially considering how often I uh, mock that line in my free time.
行くぞみんな、うん、続けていこう、uh -oh. ダメージアップあのワンシャンライクティングバッディフェンスとドゥディスドゥンチェンジェンジェンジウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーション、ウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーションを使って、ウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーションを使って、ウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーションを使って、ウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーションを使って、ウォッシュマーゲームズは、ユーコンビネーションを使って、ウォッシュマジで、uh, ね、これはあなたのことを知っているのかもしれません。私のことを知っているのかもしれません。
Sorry, I'm back. What? Is there a problem? This to the Beast King. Man, you know what? I should really be, uh... I'm pretty sure I don't have them. Defense Confusion, Electric Skills, All-Rounder Defense, Water, Accuracy Speed. Okay. Uh, take this. Oh, I don't have another attach. Uh, a D1. Oh, take this. Take a D1. Whatever. If I saved or not, I'm gonna save again. Let this be a lesson to you. But if you don't know if you saved, save again, because you don't want to lose time. Time is a very precious and valuable resource. Oh dear, I have to go all the way back. Talk about wasting time. I need to get the timing right so I can overlap it like uh, what happens in the actual game. You, you're the guy who was just here a second ago using now his account, weren't you? Poor now he had to be fooled by a liar like you into letting his account get stolen. No, if Naoi knew what you did, he'd, he'd be upset. I hate you. How dare you hurt Naoi like that? Anyway, I have nothing more to say. Go away! Peppy Rubble Digimon Sex Haver. Idiot. This this boss fight theme does kind of go crazy though. than I've had in the entire game.
red. Switching over to... Oh wow, that's good fucking damage right there. I don't care who you are. Um, damn, this thing's being fucked up. But it costs like, what? 9 versus 15. So, saves me some SP in case this fight goes on longer than I really intend it to. Damn, and the metal drop? Nice. Leomon level 10. Huh, huh. Why? Why did you pretend to be Naoya and come to this chat room? Are you trying to get me banned from the chat room for pretending to be a human? Can't Digimon chat just like humans? Are you saying Digimon and humans can't be friends? Before you got here, I never had to, I, I had never heard anyone. I just wanted to come here and listen to Naoya's stories. So that's it. You were asked to come here by Naoya's mother and pretend to be him. Naoya, he couldn't make any friends at school. He stopped going and became completely absorbed in that chat site. I was interested in the site and came to live here. When I met Naoya, I made myself look like the other characters here and we started chatting. Naoya hasn't talked to his family in a while. Sometimes he'd miss school. His family would be hard on him. That made it even harder to talk. He always, just, he always told me he wanted to talk to his family like he used to. And he wanted to go to school and get along with everybody. If now his mother is worried about him, could you please tell her to sit down with him and talk to him kindly? Could you tell him to kindly do the needful? Thanks. I'm sure now he will open up there. I'll do my best to encourage him as well. Oh, and um... Could you please not get me kicked off this chat site? Yes, of course. Woohoo! Ah, Detective, were you able to talk with Athena? He just jumped into that computer. I see. He tells her a lot, apparently. I, I didn't realize he was so worried about the family. My son is a shut-in. He's different from other kids. If he doesn't get back to school soon, I don't know what will become of him. I guess all that worry has made now and nervous about talking to me. Detective, from what you saw, what kind of person is Athena? I see. From the stories I've heard of her, she seems like a very kind person. She seems like... She seems to be someone who really cares about Naoya, which is good. I feel really bad that I doubt her intentions, which is bad. Tonight I think I'll make hamburgers. They're his favorite food, and I haven't made them for a while, because I'm a piece of shit. Fuck you, child. I doubt I'll be able to repair our relationship quickly, or with a single hamburger, but I'll start trying to listen to what my child says more carefully. Wow. Today I'm being a parent. Listen to your fucking kid. They're not just talking to fill the space. Detective, I'm so glad you took the case. Thank you so very much. No problem. Thanks for taking my learn how to be a good parent course. Uh, my price is very high. Fifteen hundred yen. Budding cyber slut. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of going crazy with the rank ups. All right. Oh, perfect timing. I was just thinking. Where is that? Demon thin, demon thin, cavalry number three. That's gonna take three seconds. I'm like, man, it's 9:05. I know if I take another case, I'm just gonna be talking for like 20 minutes. Damn! What the fuck? Is there a fucking buster sword? This thing's tight. Drink some coffee like you? I did drink some coffee. It was honey bun flavored. It tasted like shit. Granted, this was at like 2 p.m. Yeah, I'm still doing my 
cold brew and K-Cups thing, because I have too many. Um, Snowball was good, Twinkie was whatever, but it was passable. Uh, Honey Bun was actively bad. But then they tried to, like, do too much, and fucked it up really bad. Been back on the French press kick the last few weeks. Yeah, we have a French press. Shout out to Will Gamer. Um, hashtag French with the press, but... Yeah, I just, I've never used it. Oh shit, this is what Gargamon's gonna turn into. Unfortunately. I like Gargamon better. Maybe let's keep him Gargamon. Oh, I just left. Oopsies. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm i always torn between like using a French press or something like that. And just uh, cold brewing. Yeah, that's another question I've had. Could I just buy like a giant French press maybe type? Yeah, I need to like look up how to use it correctly and shit, but I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably be ending soonish. I'll probably do another like I'll do this, then the next uh story intro and then call it. But stay safe, have fun. Coffee, boil water, pour in water, wait five minutes and serve. Man, you think I got five minutes? You think I got five minutes and the time it's gonna take to boil water? Do you fucking think I am made of time? Yeah, I know I learned that lesson with uh with cold brew, cause like, like oh you got a cold brew for 24 hours, man, like. It's not the same if you don't, and I, like, I've tried it with, like, E1624 on the counter in the fridge, and it's like, yep, this is coffee. After a wait time, got it. Yeah, I might try it. I need to like bring out and clean off my bean grinder and stuff, and just start doing that. I think I'm trying to get through the. I'm trying to get through the key cups. And I'm trying to get through the instant coffee we have. Nothing beats the convenience of instant coffee. So we need to boil water. Just so need to heat it up in the microwave for a minute. Tight. I know that's a heretical take, but instant coffee, uh, it's slept on. And I think that everyone who gets snobby about it has deluded themselves into thinking that they know something that other people don't. Bustello slaps. Yeah, I have some Bustello, like, espresso. Because I didn't know anything about coffee, and I'm like, I went to Aldi and they had it, and I'm like, this looks cool. It has a yellow package, so it's probably, like, the right balance of questionable and good. Yeah, we have the Kirkland signature stuff and that shit's good. Oh yeah, the cursed, uh, the cursed Folgers, yeah. And my grandma's birthday, because old people, um, nothing against them. They had a... A pot of coffee going and it's at like 4 p.m. And that's I think that's what I drank. I drank that and like just normal soda. 
Like my one aunt brought like fucking just a whole bottle of like Crown Royale and I'm like, alright. Y'all are trying to have some fun, but I'm not. It was a fun time, I just was chilling. Not about to drink and then drive. I'm not that dumb. But the coffee is fine. It just tastes like hot water. I don't even know if there's caffeine in it. I'm, I'm sure she would have. I'm sure she would have given me free reign of the bottle if I'd asked. But I didn't want it. I don't drink no more. Was it because I had a revelation at one point? I need to go uh, tell them to research it. Um, yeah, I had a revelation at one point that I was spending my Friday... Like, I would drink on Fridays because it was a good way to wind out the week. And then uh, I realized, I'm like, why do I do this? Because it just kind of sucks and it doesn't benefit me in any way. It helps, like, release some stress, I guess, but that's about it. Um, but then I always spent Saturday feeling like dog shit. I'm like, is it really worth it if I'm just gonna get sh like I don't sleep during the week enough, and we get shittier sleep on the weekends. I'm wondering why I like feel like shit all the time. I'm like, alright, I guess I'll just cut it out then. And I did. And I like, I, I never really felt the urge to go, uh, to go drink in the first place, like, I just did it because it was something to do. And then I cut out soda because it got too expensive. I, I only drank diet anyway, so... I'm an undercover eater for food reviews, and I need some help that... I need someone to help me investigate something. Dot, dot, dot. Pants, I know it's out of the blue, but are you hungry right now? I am. I am very much so. <laughs> Get your age, you're always hungry. Actually, this case came from the web. It's quite a strange one. We have a request from someone who ranks gourmet restaurants as a personal hobby. She would like you to go to Nakano and grade the gourmet restaurants there and report back to her. The fees and expenses have all been paid up front. I decided it wasn't a risk, so I took it on. I decided to entrust this case to you guys. Hmm? What? It's the homies! Kyoko, is that egg and rice place really doing all you can eat buffets now? Can I really eat for free, Kyoko? Oh, wait. Can I really eat for free, Kyoko? Yeah, this is a present for me to all you hungry little kids. Please try your best for the best on this one. Yeah, just give me the eggs. Give me the, fuck the rice. I don't care. So the three restaurants we're going to are a Chinese restaurant, a sushi restaurant, and a tea house. Wait, what about the egg and rice place? It looks like each one of these places is in the Nakano building. Aw, uh, but what about the egg and rice place? We can visit the place in any order. I'm starving. Let's just go. But my egg and rice. All right, I kind of feel around that one. That's such a shame. I would love to go to the all you can eat egg and rice place. If if you or anyone you know runs an all you can eat egg or rice place and they egg and rice place and they want a top four point eight percent uh on Twitch streamer to eat and review their restaurant, let me know. I'll pay them in exposure. To my like 43 followers on Twitter that half of them are bots and uh my uh 67 followers I think on Twitch I know I know it's really a deal you can't refuse but yet here I am getting my deal refused so but you gotta swing for the fences or something haha <laughs> I said it was in the Nakano building, right? Am I just fucking stupid? Oh, 
Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. What the fuck is this? Broadway. Uh, yeah, that's here. What the hell? What's with that? Oh. Oh, I just need to walk up to it like that. It doesn't tell me which one it is. Cool. Huh? What if I try is this? This place is kind of run down, actually. It's falling apart. Actually, no, it's a complete dump. You must be blind. This place looks great. He, he's spitting. Arata's cooking. Because uh, the more derelict the place, there's like a very fine line between like really good and looks really good so like it can look really good it's not gonna taste very good but there's like there's a sweet spot like around here ish where you maximize it and anything past that balance is uh completely up in the air like you could have something that's like on the fucking floor falling apart mess and it's gonna taste like heaven but you might get food poisoning. So that's a risk you gotta take. But overall, I'd say I've had more good experiences with sus looking places than I've had bad. If it's been deteriorating, if it, if it's been deteriorating it means it's been here for a long time, which means customers have been coming here for a long time, which means it's good. Great, let's go in. Pants, what are you having? Uh, give me the uh, motherfucking uh, egg. The Chahan looks good, but so does the Mapo Dofu. I take the Mapo Dofu, what do you mean a question? Huh? Half a Chahan meal? Hmm, that way I could just have the parts of the Chahan I like the best. Okay, I'll go for that then. Half a Chahan and half a, and a Mapo Dofu. Here you are. Wow, they give good-sized portions here. This was a good choice. Huh? This That delicious smell. Ah, yes, it's the Sichuan pepper and the Mapo Dofu. Mmm. Oh, the Sichuan pepper is making a beautiful harmony with the even more delicious star anus. I'm going to try and put the chahan in my mouth while the aftertaste of the mapo dofu is still there. Man, that's just making me fucking hungry. This is bullshit. I should have just fucking cut my stream. Oh, that was delicious. Just like I thought. This place is amazing. That was great. Crab omelet and egg chahan with stir-fried mushroom and egg. Actual egg enjoyer. Let's fucking go. I'm walking here. Who are you? Hey, what are you doing? Come on, let's go. Uh, yes. There's a fucking mouth with you, too. to deal with the black haired chick is she actually a digimon i don't think it's been discussed what like she is family with uh the former president of kamishiro she is his daughter i think so she's kind of like uh grandfathered in all right why am i not able to find these fucking places That's Fantasy Mansion. These are all just on the first floor and stupid. It's rude to go the wrong way on the escalator. Shut up. Hard shot. Oh. The sushi restaurant was nice. Sushi! I'm not saying the first one. What's up? You seem tense. Because it's a sushi restaurant where the food doesn't come around on the conveyor belt. I've never seen that before. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, uh, what? What? 
Are you making fun of me right now? Have you ever been to a fancy sushi place? Moving on, what do you want to eat? Hmm. Uh, well, I'm definitely going for the omelet. Huh? The omelet? Uh, you don't get it at all. Huh? You know, egg was a egg was a desert a long time ago. <laughs> Uh, QA check. If you eat something sweet like that, you'll ruin your fish. When you eat sushi, you should always start with white fish. The way the experts do is they clean they eat clean tasting white fish first, then fattier fish, then sushi rolls. Ah, that's so boring! Geez, no wonder you don't get any bitches. You're such a nerd. Oh, what? I, I wasn't going to. I got mad bitches on my dick. What are you talking about? You don't even understand. I wear a fucking jumpsuit because if I don't, they'll tear it off of me. Anyway, let's go inside. Pants, what are you going to start with? Uh, I'm going to eat the uh, the California roll. Some people think they know everything about sushi and keep going on and on about it, but the best way to eat is the way you like it. Uh, still, I can't decide. At times like this, the best thing to do is to look at the chef's recommendations. Oh, today's recommendation is squid? Okay, I'll start with that then. Sure thing, one squid coming right up. Just a whole fucking squid. Okay, they're putting the sushi on my plate. You certainly don't get this kind of treatment at a cheap conveyor belt sushi place. Now then. Wow, it's plump, springy, and thick. It really looks delicious. I'll just put some soy sauce on it and pop it in my mouth. Oh, that's amazing. The squid is a little bland, but the al dente texture and the unique taste complement each other beautifully. Okay, now that I've worked up an appetite, the next one is... The poop roll. That was delicious. Ugh, I'm stuck. That was absolutely delicious. Uh, so this is why expensive sushi places like. Huh? You? You you never knew what you were talking about, did you? Huh? Well, at least I didn't just order fish eggs. Everything you've ordered is eggs. You're obsessed. Also, when you left the restaurant, you said, Oh, I so, didn't you? I just wanted to try it out once. Is that not right? Oh, I so comes with the term... Iso Sukasu is used by, only by the staff to talk to the customers, never the other way around. Hey Pants, wouldn't it be best for you to wrote the report? Cool, that's great. That way I can focus on the eating part. Hey, don't just ignore me. Uh, get ignored, shithead. Omnimon blank can be evolved from black. Uh, uh oh. Did I say fucking Omnimon sloppy mode? <laughs> oh, no. Omnimon sloppy mode. What the fuck? That's so fucking cursed. Like, I'm pretty sure my brain just, like, ignored that so that I wouldn't, uh, read it. Oh, Rudo. Wow, this place sure does have a lot of menu options for a tea house. Curry, pancake, salty mackerel, set meal. Looks like this place serves all kind of food. So what are you having? Hmm. Ah, they have an egg set meal. Three second helping. This is the egg and rice place that Kyoko said had all, an all you can eat buffet. Ah, uh, but they have a rice omelet meal as well. Hmm, rice omelet. All right, let's go inside. Pants, what do you want to order? Uh, give me the egg. A tea house? Cool, I like the retro feel of this place. It's all black because they turned off all the lights. They couldn't afford it. They're serving such high quality food. They really like the idea of dining in the dark. The menu has so much on it. I really can't choose. Huh? Neapolitan pasta? Obviously the best pasta is, a pasta is from a pasta restaurant, but I like this place. Okay, I'll go for it. You're Neapolitan, sir. Here you go. Nice. Bright red tomato sauce on thick spaghetti. Wow, this place really does good Neapolitan pasta. And look at that chopped sausage on top. I can't resist. It's pasta. 
After the taste of the tomato sauce is gone, the spice of the chili comes in strong. This is no kid's dish. Mmm, not bad at all. Well, the thing about putting grated cheese on top is, some people put it on before they start, whereas I prefer to add it halfway through. No, you always put it on before you start, what are you fucking talking about? I don't grate cheese either, I just put the fucking, the whole brick in there. That was delicious! Ugh, I'm stuffed! The price and taste are astonishingly good. The range of foods on the menu is very wide. Just what you'd expect from a Nakano restaurant. Yeah, looks like this place has a lot of regulars. Wow, you really were hungry today. That's the first time I've ever seen one single human stomach su su take such a beating. Uh... <laughs> hey, I'm done with this report. Time to get back to the office. I'm back to the office. Did you write the report, Pants? Fuck. Did you write the report, Pants? Yeah, the report is good, but it's a pain in the ass to read. While we were eating, this guy just kept talking to himself and never spoke a word to the rest of us. Wow, I never thought you'd have such a talent for writing reports. So by the way, who is this undercover tester client anyway? He kept his true name hidden. I only know his web handle, so I don't actually know. And anyway, even if I knew, I'd have to keep it that I'd have to keep that information confidential, so I couldn't say. What? Oh, come on, Kyoko. I really want to know. This undercover examiner. Who the hell is he? You must be ready to burst after all those restaurants. How about some coffee? We could try a new blend. Use your kosho and sour cream. Bruh, what? Get some help. Um, I guess I'll, I guess I'll do some clean up tasks. Hopefully I don't get fucking stuck into another story beat. Someone say sour cream? Yeah, Yoko did. I need to eat, and if I don't, I'll cry. And you don't want to see that. No one wants to. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be very tiny blue. I don't care if you. I'm just gonna fucking send it. Ooh, eh. Yeah, Hi Blue's doing uh, co-op cuties with Whiskey Gamer. They're playing AI Somnium Files. Very cool. Very good. Um, yeah. So that's all for me. Um. I should be back on Monday, barring any weird private server uh, hyper focus. Um, maybe I'll do something this weekend. Probably not, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, uh, that's all for me tonight. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye now.